Hey everybody, this is Uber Jonathan. Back for more Mother Six. Mother <laughs> Six, Mother One, Part Six. So, well, off screen, I went back to Magic Can't using the Onyx hook. I got the big bag and got ten up a couple of levels, and I learned some new PSI. PSI Shield Alpha, which shields you, which uh, reduces damage with PSI attacks, quick up, which raises your speed for battle, and uh, Forty Slip, which is an automatic runaway move, so I got away from all them magic snails. <laughs> so we're going to be back on our path to Marysville, and we ran into wolves. Wolves are like the stray dogs from earlier. And one thing that you'll notice is when you fight a stray dog is that it loads the wolf, but then puts a collar on it. Oh yeah, one thing you find to notice is that they only were doing one damage, and that is because... Um, oh yeah, I got the gold ring for an antenna. I got enough money for that. So that's why they're not doing really damage at all. But those level ups that I did get, these fights are still <laughs> so annoying. Come on, die. Ah, yes. It's so exciting when you caught when you time the deaths of innocent animals. Ah, ooh, little saucers, they are. Not that strong at all. I don't know if I can one hit KO him yet. I only really have about a small amount of HP. I yeah, they don't have very much. They're not that strong. But I think it's kind of weird because there are they are UFOs that you're destroying with a baseball bat. So it's kind of weird. Come on, these fights are so. Pointless, you're just doing one damage. Okay, good. Now give me my experience. Sweet. Okay. There's one enemy here, though, that even with these level ups that I did get in the gold ring, it's still going to be very annoying. That is a bear. But we didn't run into you. Okay, so now we're up in Marysville, as you can see on the map, and we're going to want to go into this building right here. Remember how I mentioned that, I don't know if I actually mentioned this, but you cannot go in buildings that have square doors and no signs, but this has no square door and no signs, so it's like a trick. Now, one thing you can do is you can come here, no, not long room. This room right here, talk to the nurse. The nurse will, if you talk to her, she will restore all your HP. That's pretty neat. But what you let's talk to him really quick. He looks he look, matches the back. Wait a minute. I don't believe I've seen you before. You must not be around here from here, are you? No. Show me what you have. You don't have anything dangerous, do you? I guess not. <sighs> it's too bad that the order of the route is locked. Maybe you'd like to join me. I was gonna sneak out and play with my Game Boy. Yeah. You don't talk very much, do you? Well, I answered your question, and I don't know how that's not talking. I heard strawberry to tofu is popular in big cities. I'd like to taste some. That actually sounds pretty good. Look, it's the teacher. The gym teacher made me do extra... I guess it's not. The gym teacher made me do extra push-ups again. I'd rather do sit-ups, though. <laughs> it still reminds me of the kid in my gym class last year. But who's in here? I don't want to go in the menu. How can you get lost in a schoolyard? I just can't believe it. Oh, wait, well, let's not bother talking to these kids anymore. It's a lot of bullshit. You go up here and there's a padlock on the door. You can't get up to the roof, which you're going to have to do. Now, there's one room you notice on the bottom floor. 
on the right side that I did not go in. That's the far right room. Now that we checked that, we can go in. And there's the janitor. Let's talk to him. Of course the door to the roof is locked. We can't have students sneaking out to play games. And they should be studying, you know? Yep. It's not that big of a problem. My wife is a bigger problem. She doesn't get out of bed until afternoon each day. She won't even make me pack me a brown bag lunch. Isn't that just horrible? Yes. Then when she gets up, she goes shopping. Luckily, I hid the credit cards from that woman. Don't you think she's a terrible wife? No. When she was young, she was very pretty. Come to think of it, she's not that bad after all. Would you like some tea? Sure. You're a pretty good kid. You say you need to go up to the roof? Follow me. Now, if you actually say, um... Yes, she is a bad wife. He'll get mad. Which is kind of weird after all that trash talk. And she says, it's like talking to somebody about like sports or something. Be like, yeah, the Bengals suck. And they'll be like, yeah, they do. And then you reply, what are my favorite team? What are you saying? You jerk. My wife was the first Miss Marysville in history. So actually, if you hold down the two button, he walks faster because the, the run button makes the game go at double speed. Okay, if I lock the roof. While you're up there, make sure you take in the view. It is unforgettable. The view is actually kind of funny how this is a school, no, a different shape than the actual building when you enter it. And that's Marysville down there, really small. But what you want to do is you're going to check this trash can, just this question mark. Now talk to the trash can. Who are you? I won't come out. If I do, everyone will pick on me. You want to be my friend? Don't tell anyone, but I stole some explosives. Yes, I'm coming out now. Ooh, he came out. Okay, so want to talk to him? Hi, I am Lloyd. I wanted to fly the bottle rockets that the sweet little factory was producing. So, you, this is Lloyd from earlier, from when we were naming your characters. Can't get him to join your party yet. So, you, and he mentioned bottle rockets from Little Sweet's factory. And, we're going to have to go get some. So, okay, well let's go check out Mary really quick here. Got a department store. Let's see if they got anything worthwhile. Drugs. Sports goods. Nope. Talk. Welcome. What can I sell you? Wooden bat. Okay, the aluminum bat, $1,000. I bought the gold ring earlier, so I don't know if I have enough for that. I only have $27.15. Let's call the dad. Save and see how play. This is your dad. I've trained him. Yeah. I've no, I don't have enough. I'm just a couple hundred dollars short. We want that would really be helpful, but, you know. Can't get everything, I suppose. Like your mom, you never want to stop. Please don't push yourself so hard. So, would that make his dad no mind? I am not going to finish that because that was a very sexual comment I was about to make. So you want to go to Little Sweet's Factory, head over, you want to go south of Marysville down, it's that building you saw earlier, so you're going to head south here. Ah, oh, just a regular old wolf. Every time I see a wolf, I think of Wolf from Star Fox, because in Super Smash Brothers, um... If you click on him, the Wii Remote, his voice is so stupid, he's just like, play time's over. It's annoying my cousin, though, because he was playing that, and I just kept cl clicking it over and over again, so it just kept going like, play time's over, play time's over. And I was doing Snake, so. What? Well, wait, that sounded wrong, but no, I, I kept doing Snake. Ugh. I kept playing Snake's voice to annoy him. And then, you know, he ran over and hit me and we started but whatever smash I could have used that on the first turn but whatever not like it did more than one damage so here is little sweets factory come on in this is looks a lot like an area that you're going to go to a little on later but it's not nearly as confusing as I think Check this present, a magic herb. Okay, that item's useless because of the big bag. I'll just use it now to recover that 1 HP. So. I 
forget if there are enemies here. They probably are. Probably the snails again. God, the snails. Butter knife. That's an item for Teddy later in the game. His weakest item. You do not need that, because you could just go get the... I guess there are enemies here, but you know. Ooh, Barbots. Barbot Junior. PK Bean Gamma. Ooh, but the Franklin Badge bounced it back. There was no effect. Now they, so as you see, they have a Bean Gamma. One hit KO move. Franklin Badge deflects it, so make sure you always have that with you. Except for damage of one. Other than Bean Gamma, they are not that powerful at all, but they're annoying because they keep dodging your attacks. Yes. Finally, he's there. After like three whole turns of one damage and dodging. Ugh. Really? Oh, rat. That is the big challenge. I could have killed that without my bat. Go up these stairs, check here. All the doors say exit on them, I just noticed that. Magic herb! What's with all these magic herbs? No, do not use the cash card, use the magic herb. Covered by two. I got dose of HP os, back os. Ugh. Another craft. Dear God. How much HP e experience do they even give? Only three. Well, hopefully this is a useful item. Antidote. Not really, but uh. And a bar bar. Fun, fun, fun. Okay, now that we're back from that fight, let's go on. Uh, you what? Uh, why would, uh, why would there ever be a rat on a ladder? If this, how is this factory even a running place? What running factory would have barbots and rats running all over the place? Seriously. Quick capsule. Um, quick capsule, go ahead, use that on min 10, it'll increase his speed by 5. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and throw away that antidote. With healing alpha, the antidote's pretty useless. Ugh. Why do I keep thinking that there's something I forgot to mention? I cannot put my finger on it now. With all these rats, there's no wonder I can't remember. It's making me angry. Okay, I think this is where you're going to want to go. Check this trash can. There's a bottle rocket. That is not what I want to get. Just trying to go into that door. Rats like five. I guess I'm never actually gonna No, don't check. Plastic Are you serious? There was a plastic bat in there. Should have been an old Why would uh, I guess they put that there just in case you missed it at the very beginning of the game and I got another magic herb. Just could use that. <sighs> Ugh. Rat. Draws neither.
Okay, now I can finally check the present. Life up cream. Now that's a useful item. But it was guarded by a rat. Whatever. Oh my god. You know, the bar bots are annoying like the rats. They're just as easy. But they give it a bunch of experience. Why can't I run into some bar bots instead? Or better yet, not any enemies at all. This is pissing me off. Oh wait, I already went over there. That's good. Go down over here. Oh wait, I already went in there here. Okay. You know, I can When I go into the next factory that you get to go into, because that one's a lot more confusing. Now. I'm gonna have such a swell time if I'm having a little trouble navigating around Sweet's little factory. The rat became quiet. Oh my God, 2,900 HP exactly. Holy crap. That's a bunch. What's in here? Ooh. I think this is actually a good item. Fight capsule. Can't kill anything else. No. Ugh. Now I'll get that later. I'll probably come back for that once I get Lloyd. Because it's that item, the fight capsule, is probably better to have with Lloyd. So the rats are going to suffer 42 damage and become quiet. You know, I'm pretty sure that eventually one of these rats would, be, would probably die from getting beat over the head with a wooden baseball bat. Maybe that's what it means by being quiet. They like just kill over or something. I don't know. I'm just going around here right now, just getting some of the items, even though I can't really carry anymore. Off screen, uh, actually, you know what, no, after I check this present, I'm going to leave Sweet's Little Factory and off screen. You won't. Yeah, I won't. But off screen, I'm going to Magic Herb, yay, I'm going to come back here and get some of these items, check some of these items, I'm going to get that fight cap, so when I get Lloyd back in the party, so, you know, if you like this episode of Let's Play Mana 1, comment, and give me some thumbs up, and subscribe, so... In the next part, we are going to go back to Tweet Elementary School. Gonna give the bottle rockets to Lloyd. Finally, get ourselves another party member. See you all next time. Actually, really quickly, let's not end it off here. Let's go ahead and get Lloyd into our party. Now, with the bottle rocket in hand, go ahead and return to Twinkle Elementary. And go back to the roof. And use it on him. It's I'll just talk to him, actually. Hi, I'm Lloyd. I wanted to play bottle rockets at the sweet little factory was producing. Wow, this bottle rocket is sure to cause a bang. We may be able to make some more on our own. Come with me to the lab. Okay, so Lloyd is going to... Uh, later, we should go to Duncan's factory. I've heard they're constructing an incredible rocket, so... Hold two, make him go fast. Hold B, make him go faster. So you're gonna, he's gonna take you to the lab. They call me names, weakling or four eyes or worse. I'm sure that you've heard them. Yeah, actually, if you talk to the bullies in the school, they will um, talk about how they like to beat up Lloyd. So, is that room we came in earlier? Your bottle rocket and my great, isn't it? What? There's an explosion, and everything's been blown up. So, very interesting. Now, okay, now we have Lloyd in our party, and we could advance on, but Lloyd is level 1, so that kind of sucks. So go ahead and get out your onyx hook, teleport to magic camps, and talk to this cat. Or catfish, whatever. I'm a swimming cat. Have you heard of a magic candy that gives strength and power to a helpless child? No. The boy with the glasses can surely use the candy. 
Okay, so use the magic candy on Lloyd. Lloyd's energy increased by four. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to grind Lloyd up to um, around level 13 or 14 or something. So first you're going to want to start a magic hand, then fight the enemies at Marysville once he's strong enough. So next time we will advance on to Duncan's factory. See you.